With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students. Question is, if the point A, 2 comma minus 4 is equidistant from point B, 3 comma 8 and Q, minus 10 comma Y, then find the value of Y. We have to find value of Y. And also we have to find distance PQ. Let's solve this. Okay. So I'm going to take two points. First point is P whose coordinates are 3 comma 8. And second is Q whose coordinates are minus 10 comma Y. Okay. Now as distance of A from both the points is same. So A is over here and a coordinate is 2 comma minus 4. Okay. Now, according to question, AP is equals to AQ. AP is equals to AQ. So, I am going to write the information given in question. AP is equals to AQ. Now, I am going to use distance formula for finding distance AP. And distance formula is x2 minus x1 square plus y2 minus y1 square. So, x2, 3 minus 2, that is x1, square is 1, and 1 square is 1. Plus, 8 minus, minus 4 is 8 plus 4, that is 12 square, 144 is equals to a square root a cube. Okay, distance a cube. So, square root x2 minus x1 square square plus y2 minus y1 square square. So, from here, we will get... I am considering this x2, y2 and this as x1, y1. So, 2 minus minus 10 is 12. Again, 12 square is 144 plus minus 4 minus y square. Minus 4 minus y ka whole square. Okay. Now, squaring both sides. Squaring both sides. We will get 1 plus... 144 is equals to 144 plus when I will take minus sign from both then minus to the square will be plus this will become 4 plus y ka whole square and both sides 144 will cancel out and we will get 4 plus y ka whole square is equals to 1 and now we will get 4 plus y equals to plus minus 1 taking plus sign coordinates of y will be minus 3 and taking minus sign coordinates of y will be minus 5 okay so there are two points okay now I have to find distance pq okay so first I am going to put the value we get using plus sign that is y coordinate minus 3. So, coordinates of q will be minus 10 and minus 3. Okay, minus 10 and minus 3. So, from here distance pq using distance formula square root x2 minus x1 square plus y2 minus y1 square. So, 3 minus minus 10, 13 square, 169 plus 8 minus minus 3, 11, that is 121, and this will become a square root 0, 8, 9, and 290. Okay, square root 290. Now, by taking minus sign, the coordinates of Q will be minus 10, okay, comma, okay, minus 5. And from here, distance, PQ will be equals to a square root, okay, 3 minus minus 10 is 13 and 13 square is 169 plus 8 minus minus 5 and that will also be 169. So, this will become 8, 3, 38. Okay, so these are the two values of PQ and these are the two values of Y that we will get in this question. Thank you.
give a student okay if we want to see how this two points will be there so see this is our suppose this is our line x equals to minus 10 so at x equals to minus 10 this point will lie on x equals to minus 10 okay okay so this will lie on line x equals to minus 10 so this side there will be one length whose distance both will be equal and same there can also be some point which is minus with x coordinate minus 10 whose distance will be as same as the ap okay so these are the one length between pq and this is the second length between pq thank you students for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today